Hey there, welcome back everybody. This time, we are going to be doing a review on some of this Alien Express from Northwest Alchemy. <clears throat> they got, I believe, just Ice Wax um, made this for them. And <clears throat> I was given a little bit of it to sample out and let you guys know what I think. So that's what we're going to do today. Um... I uh, guess I'll just wish everybody a happy holidays here. Um, I haven't made a video in a couple of days. It's been kind of <coughs> holiday, holiday like around here, and um, some family in town and, and whatnot. So <clears throat> I wanted to uh, at least make a video uh, today to make up for it. Bit of a review. Let's see here. Uh, so yeah, just Isax made this. Um, looks beautiful. It's really, really light. Really, really nice. Um, smells really nice. Obviously, just can smell the pineapple. Pretty much everything you cross that pineapple with, um, it seems to just dominate. Uh, I think I just put barely on that Wonka pineapple that I ran. Um, I barely, barely put like maybe a quarter of it was Pineapple Express and the rest was Wonka. And you couldn't taste anything else but the pineapple, even though that was the case. So this is a good strain to run for Bubble Ash, that's for sure. Um, I actually, I went down to Greenhouse uh, Cooperative and smoked out with them and I uh, had a couple good conversations but I ended up leaving my gold digger down there which sucks that is really one of my favorite tools but I have purchased a couple more online hopefully I make it down there soon to grab that one also we're just gonna be sprinkling her in there that looks a little excessive Let the glassy don't work that great at this but whatever if you guys want more melt <clears throat> excuse me go check out a couple of the other videos on the channel always melting up some hatch and I hope everybody had a great holiday out there I know I did got a bunch of stuff I didn't really expect to get I know I can't be the easiest person to to shop for, but I think everybody did all right. Really fun times, good food, good hash. I mean, what else could you ask for? <clears throat> I have um, more of my hash that I've made too that's going to be coming down the line. Um, it's already made, I just figured this would be easier to do a little review video. Haven't done one of those in a little while. So I still have hash that I made that will be making an appearance. Mm -hmm. It would. Mm, smells real pineapple-y. So sweet and fruity. We're gonna take this old chopper. I think somebody was asking me to actually weigh one of these. Again, let's see how that works out. There's just nothing but sift on here. <laughs> Uh, eh, just like I thought, there's about a point two, maybe close to a point three, <laughs> big enough in whatever case. Not the biggest hit I've taken, but. It's definitely some quality 
which makes a huge difference uh, when you take hits of hash. Um, the more quality hash it is, the the bigger the hit's going to be. More s smoke or vapor generated. The potency of the smoke is completely different. It's a lot different than oil and other things. Um, when you get the fire, <clears throat> you just need less. For sure. Or, or that's all you can handle is less, really. Alright. Well, let's do this. I got this other patty here, actually. Let me show you. Now I pressed out, uh, gosh, it had to be, it was a couple days before Christmas. So real, real stable. Uh, this is the uh, Purple Kush I already did that I made. I already did a smoke video on it. And real stable, still real greasy, definitely dried proper. Um, I mean, it's not waxing up or anything. Some of these other ice waxes that I've gotten from other people, you know, you keep them on your desk for a week like this and... Uh, they'll start that white out effect where it'll you know basically start to butter and um, I mean inevitably fresh frozen I imagine if I leave this out for a month it probably will do the same but maybe not seems really really stable real greasy and yummy for sure so That's what I've been pooping on for the last couple of days. I made a big old patty of that so I could serve up to friends and family without having to iron it up. <coughs> and it, <coughs> it was a little too strong for a lot of them, so I got a bunch left. So I'll just be poofing on it. All right. Let's see if I can get a little bit of that drop down in there. I kind of want this not to be at the angle it was last time. Alright. <clears throat> the Alien Express from Northwest Alchemy, made by Just Ice Wax. Cheers, YouTube. Oh man, I actually <coughs> really, really enjoy that. Ooh. Oh man, definitely got a head rush. <coughs> it's usually a good sign, definitely potent. Ooh. Definitely a six star, not really any residue left. You can tell that it was this that I smoked on. There's a little teeny beady 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 bit of residue, but that's probably just from the tip of the nail. <coughs> Overheated it a little bit. <coughs> Potency was through the roof. Definitely got the sweats. That was a pretty <coughs> decent sized hit too for this quality. <coughs> oh, I do taste the pineapple, but not as much as was in the aroma of it. I really taste the alien 
uh, a little more in this and that's it's good it's has that nice <coughs> OG lemon flavor and then at the very end a little bit of fruity from the pineapple <coughs> this is actually a great mix great ratio too it's actually the first time I've ever smoked the Pineapple Express with anything else that it didn't overpower. So, and it went together really well. I really like this. <coughs> I'm glad I got uh, some more of it too. Stuff is fire. Definitely would swoop this up. Whew. I also... <coughs> I mean, not that a lot of you care, this is actually BHO right here, but it's a little bit of Naughty's Pineapple Haze, I think that's what it is. I don't know if you follow him on Instagram, he just did a live resin nug run of this stuff, and uh, I was gifted a little piece of it. It smells amazing, I haven't really done too much with it, I don't really smoke too much BHO. Um, but it smells, I mean, I just did the, I just want to show you because it looks amazing. I mean, <coughs> it's, it's, it's even whiter than it's coming up on camera. It's just white. That's the way I would describe it. It's just white. And it smells, I mean, I don't know if you guys have seen that terpene infused oil, the clear or whatnot. I think I might even have some around here. Um... The terpenes, the smell and the terpenes off of this is almost as strong as some of that stuff. And this is natural. So, big props to Naughty. Has, and whoever grew that, <coughs> that strain is great, great, great. Uh, BHO, I'm just keeping it around really to sniff on it. it smells really amazing. <coughs> Jeez, that pot, Alien Express is just kicking my ass. Alrighty. Well, um, I think that's about it. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll catch you next time.